The UMass Lowell Hockey Riverhawks continue to make this 25th anniversary of Hockey East season very, very interesting. Tonight was about effort, it was about grit, it was about hard work, it was about determination, it was about taking advantage of the very few opportunities you are presented with. It was about terrific goaltending as well. It was about a team just refusing to give in. That's the testimony to the players, the, the character they have, the, the grit, the determination. You play in this building, hostile crowd, kill penalties like we did, block shots. That's the type of uh, game that we've got to continue. It wasn't our best game, but it was a good road game for us, and it was a bottom line game. We did enough to win in spite of some adversity. The UMass Lowell Hockey Riverhawks on Saturday night knocked off the sixth in the nation, third in Hockey East, University of Vermont Catamounts, by a final of one to nothing. And yes, one nothing games can be entertaining, and yes, one nothing games can be exciting, and yes, I suppose it goes without saying that this Saturday night's one nothing game was heart stopping. Now along the boards, Stacy to Carlson behind the net for Lennis. Lennis flips it in front, and it's missed by. Wow, Stacy. Well, I, uh, I knew we were down. I knew they had uh, a couple forwards there on defense, so I intercepted the pass coming through and uh, chipped it off the boards. And, and Worthington sends it the other way, chases it down. Just took off and it was rolling, and all I saw was Benny going. Worthington, shot, score! Short handed, an impossible angle! And uh, fired on net and get a rebound, and it went in. Paul Worthington wound up. Fired and found the back of the net. Definitely was knuckle puck, but uh, no, I wasn't really picking a spot. I was just trying to put it on net. And I, like I said, I saw Benny going, and I was hoping for a rebound. But even better happened. I scored. River Hawks take a one to nothing lead. The River Hawks would get a goal from Paul Worthington, shorthanded, as the River Hawks penalty killing unit shut down the Vermont power play. The Catamounts 0 for 5. The River Hawks have shut down power play opportunities now 27 consecutive times. Penalty killing is a hard thing. You got to have four guys determined to block shots. You know, do anything they can to you know basically keep the puck out of the net. And you know, we've been having an unbelievable penalty kill all year, and it just shows the guys on the team that we got. It's you know a lot of guys are willing to block shots. A lot of guys that are willing to do anything they need to to, to you know help this hey, team win. You know, we're we're in a, we're in good shape. The guys are doing a great job, and we just you know keep one foot in front of the other. We'll be fine. And Carter Hutton would make 21 saves, including some very, very big ones. Lennis to Milo, toward the net, shot, kick, save by Hutton the beauty! And he kicks it all the way out of the zone, 15 seconds remain! But obviously 14. you're getting a shutout in, in a big game like this. Made some really, really big saves early on, uncharacteristically didn't handle the puck like he usually does. But that being said, when we needed a key clear, he got it on his backhand and cleared it. So all the credit to Carter for hanging in there. This one's over, River Hawks win it one nothing. River Hawks win it one nothing. River Hawks win it. Blaze McDonald was pleased. He probably found some teaching points. That's the nature of the game. But in a game and in a sport where it's about did you win or did you lose, the River Hawks won. And where it's about standings in home ice, the River Hawks are in the midst of the battle, not just for home ice, but at the moment for third place. The River Hawks, two points behind Vermont, two points behind New Hampshire. They're tied for third. There are still four games left to the regular season, two big weekends, an awful lot to be decided, and no question in observers' minds that this team is ready to go out and prove they belong in the top four, and no question in the players' minds that they are a better hockey team than they have even shown to this point. Playing, we're playing well, and uh, you know the best part is we all think we can play better, so it's a great sign going into you know going into the rest of the season into the playoffs. Uh, we're, we're really pushing right now, and we, we think we got a better team than we're playing right now, which is even better because I mean we're winning all the time so uh, you know we just got to keep going here and uh, we'll see what happens the rest of the season but you know we never get ahead of ourselves we're just trying to win win shift after shift again the Riverhawks knocking off the University of Vermont a one nothing final <laughs>